Hey guys. I think I've, uh, I think I've gone live. I think I'm having a bit of trouble trying to go live, yeah. Morning, Mr. Reed. Morning, James. Let's wait for a few more people to turn up. Cheers for the poster, Dan, by the way. Gosh. Got your stickers up there already. Morning, Mr. Gibbs. So, because this week is Chili of the Valley week, I've got some sauces to review. So I'm going to try these this morning. I want to start with the Children of the Valley, it's Smoky Oaks. So this one, all the proceeds of this one, all go to charities of Dan Reed's Children's Choice. So we'll give this a go. Smells rush that. Just get that lovely smoky smell. So I'll just give this a, a whirl. Wow, that's not going to last long at all. I'll just pop through the ingredients there. We've got cider vinegar, candied sour black cherries and syrup, sugar, water, glucose syrup, sour cherry juice, brown sugar, citric acid, water, tomato powder, bourbon whiskey, chipotle powder, salt, oregano and vanilla extract. But wow. It's got a sort of... Um, Smoky barbecue taste. The cherries really work well in there. Amazing texture there, yeah, that would be great as a marinade as well. Um, that would be awesome, probably on chicken. Um, but no, on like steaks, it'd be great on steak. Um, any sort of meat really. That's awesome, that one. That is definitely not going to last long at all. So next one, I'm going to do Greedy Pig, because I am one. Just got to say, these labels are awesome as well. I don't know if the camera's really picking up that. Fantastic artwork. So ingredients. In this one we've got cola, 33%. Molasses, 25%. Tomato concentrate, 8%. Cider vinegar, sugar, chilies, salt, chipotle powder, onion powder, garlic powder, Henderson's relish, uh, plain caramel, sugar syrup, salt, tamarinds, garlic oil, pepper, cloves, sweetener, so... There we go, I'll give that a whirl. Sounds a little bit thicker, I think. Clean that up now. Definitely got a full spoonful there. Mmm. A 
Well, as I say, these are quite mild. Not much heat to them. But flavour is on point. Now, I know um, the Nuke Awards last year, we tried some jerky that was made with this. But wow. Don't worry, Dan, I'm not going to be wasting what I've just spilled there. I'm going to lick that up. <laughs> but wow. That is lush. Another awesome one by Chili of the Valley. So next up, we have got Dark Siren. I believe this has got some rum in as well. So ingredients, we've got brown sugar, black flag porter, cherry juice, concentrate, white wine vinegar, tomato puree, molasses, chipotle, garlic powder, onion powder, salt, spices. So, give that one a try. Now this one there's a little bit run, yeah? You could probably drink it. That smells really nice. Definitely. Let's give this one a try. I just have to be careful of this one. It's, uh, I don't know if you can see. It's a little bit run, yeah? Mmm. That is lovely. See, there's, there's definitely not much heat with these. You probably could just, just... Mmm. That is nice. Damn, these sauces aren't going to last long at all. Yeah, I think Stu probably would chug that. Mm. That would that would be nice um just to pep up a beef stews or any kind of stew or that's lovely. Probably will go well on chicken as well. Uh, yeah Kev they are superb sauces so far anyway. Anything I've had of done really's been uh, been rather nice. So last but not least, I've got the Gourmet Chipotle Ketchup. So, ingredients, and this one is tomato 79%, chipotle mash, water, smoked red jalapenos, salt, vinegar, brown sugar, cider vinegar, garlic, smoked paprika, olive oil, salt and spices. Oh, let's give this one a try. This one is a little bit thicker by the looks of it. I'll just get the spoon in there. A nice teaspoon there. This is Amy's favourite. Mix a dark siren with olive oil for a great salt dressing. Huh? That's a good idea. Right, so this is the gourmet chipotle ketchup. Mm. Just a little bit more heat to that one from the other three. Um, not much, just like like. Slight little tingle on the tongue, but the tomatoes in there. I don't know what else I can taste, I think it might be the garlic. It's got garlic powder in it. Garlic, yeah? Mm. So that's the chipotle ketchup. That is another 
superb one that's not going to last long. Now that'll go well on your bangers. Uh, probably chicken as well, Kev. Just for you. But yeah, check out um, Chili of the Valley. Mr. Dan Reed, he's doing some awesome stuff. Um, yeah. That's it, um, that's it for today. I will catch you all later.